Hey everyone, welcome to my new tutorial. In this tutorial, I am gonna show how to make Greek character with Duik in After Effects. Let's begin. Vectors from freepick.com, I will add down that link and project files. First step, select here to check this all layers and right mouse, precoms, add name, face and click OK. Then open face composition and select this region of interest and select this here, okay, and go to composition, crop comp to region of interest, okay. Then select this check, unhide, move to here, select this here, control D for duplicate, move to app, and select this check, click toggle switch, change non to alpha matte head to. Okay, nice. Next step, let's go to window, open duik bezel 2, and click this icon, and select connector, click this circle. Okay, nice. Then select these layers. Okay, and this check. Press P in the keyboard and select these all positions like this. And right mouse, spread dimension. Okay, then make keyframe. Okay. Go to 10 keyframe. For shortcut, you can use hold shift and press page down in the keyboard. And make again new keyframes. And go to again 10 keyframe. Make new keyframes. Okay. Then select a right. Move to left. And select this air left. Move to left, okay, and select this nose, move to left, and a brown, move to left, okay, and hair, move to left, and this check. Okay, nice. Let's go to pen tool and make, go to center keyframe, make modes like this. Okay. And hold alt, make smooth layer. Okay, nice. Select this shape layer, add name, mods, mods, and change color, maybe white, okay, and press P, go to one second, select this position, right mouse, separate dimension, and make keyframes, go to here, again keyframe, and last keyframes, okay. And in first keyframe, select this mouse and move to left. Okay. And go to center. And last keyframe. In last keyframe, move to this mouse right and select this check. Again, right. And this nose right. And this a bronze. Like this. And this air move to left, and this air right move to left again. Okay, let's see. And select this hair, move to right. Okay. So, in this time, select this Y position, first keyframe, move to down, and air right, move to down, and air left, move to down, 
okay and nose okay and a brown like this two a bronze move the down okay and here move to down okay let's see okay nice in last keyframe select this mouse y position and move to down okay and select this air right move to down air left move to down and nose move to down y position okay and a brown one and a brown two move to down again and here move to down okay so let's see okay all k frames is done let's make sliders in this connector area select this slider okay nice select these two sliders move to here select all layers x positions k frames like this only x position k frames not y position okay all x position selected and go to here select this x and click connected properties okay nice then select this y k frames y position k frames okay nice and go to again do it select axis y and click connect to properties okay nice let's see oh nice very good okay nice let's make next slider for this a animation select this all layers and close okay and select this air right air left nose and here here to check and here click toggle switch click this icon and this icon okay nice select this a press s click this icon and make new scale k frame go to 10 k frame change 100 to 5 and again go to 10 k frame change again 100 okay i have three k frame and go to do it click this icon create a slider controller click this and select this two shape layer controller move to down and select these three k frames go to here and click connect to properties okay nice let's see okay nice done okay select this a and click this icon okay nice next step select this a brown press air make k frame go to again 10 k frame make k frames and again 10 k frame okay and in this time select this slider move to left and this a brown let's change rotation like this and select this last k frame change like this okay nice then click this circle okay this is our new airborne rig and select this keyframes click this connect to properties okay nice select this controller press air and let's see okay nice select this a bronze layers again click this icon okay so in this time select this here controller press p and change position coordinates to zero okay 
and let's make new rig controller for these modes let's select these modes okay open contents shape one and part one make new part keyframe go to 10 keyframe and create new keyframe again go to 10 keyframe and new keyframe okay i have again three keyframes in this time go to pen tool select this pen tool and select this part one change path like this okay okay this is our center keyframe normal modes and last keyframe again select this part one and change shape okay hold alt make smooth okay nice then click this icon again new slider select these two sliders move to here and select these keyframes click this connect to properties okay nice let's see okay nice okay all rig is done let's make animation select this slider rigs like this and change color red and close duik okay select this red shape layers press p make new position keyframe and go to 10 keyframe change this slider to right okay and this mouse move to right okay and this air okay and this select this angel click this position keyframe and press air open rotation go to first keyframe make new rotation keyframe and go to 10 keyframe change rotation okay okay and this time again make new keyframes go to 10 keyframe and change this slider again change this air slider this very useful for character animation lowers again this a brown sliders and this mouse okay let's see nice in this time again make new keyframes and go to 10 keyframe select this first keyframes for loop animation okay and press n let's see nice select this keyframes right mouse keyframe and easy is nice let's back to main composition move to here to here okay and go to palm behind move to anchor point down press air make rotation keyframe go to 10 keyframe and change rotation maybe seven and last keyframe here make new rotation keyframe and go to 10 keyframe change rotation and last keyframe here make new keyframe go to 10 and select first keyframe ctrl c ctrl v select these keyframes right mouse keyframe assistant easy is 
and in this time go to first keyframe select face hold shift press p make new position keyframe and go to center move to down and in last keyframe select first keyframe ctrl c ctrl v for bones animation okay nice select keyframes right mouse keyframe as easy is and select these keyframes ctrl c and ctrl v here and this okay let's see okay nice so thank you for watching my tutorial and don't forget to subscribe channel like video and please follow me on instagram good luck